Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we are driving on the Southern Coastal Highway Improvement Project. This is the largest road project on the way in Jamaica. One of the largest road projects in Jamaica. It involved building 140 kilometers of road between Harborview and Portland. 17 kilometers of four lane highway like what you're looking at now. It involved removing over 600 structures between Harborview and Yalos to expand the road from two lanes to four lanes. It involves putting in over 400 street lights. There you can see them in the middle of the road. It involves running fiber optic cable. It involves putting in 11 stoplights. It involves putting in the first set of stoplights in Thomas has ever known. This road is what you call a game changer. Now, it took China Harbor Engineering Company a very long time to build this road. It's, this project started with 10 local contractors and they're down to between three, three. Seven of them could not manage this road. No, I was reading an article about why the PNP mayor Mar of Marin Bay did not attend the opening of this road. And there is a part in that article that I'm going to read to you that surprised me. According to the PNP, Former Prime Minister Portia Simpson Miller had created and approved a grand vision for the Southern Coastal Highway Improvement Project, which has been downscaled by the government. They added that while they have compromised and accepted a smaller scale project, the people of St. Thomas should not be made party to a political pantomime of opening an incomplete road. Now the part that struck me is where they say downscaled by the government. Guys, if anybody knows what plans the PMP had that would involve this road that we are looking at to be considered a downscaled by the government. They added that while they have compromised and accepted a smaller scale project. So whatever the plan was that the PNP had on the the former Prime Minister Portia Simpson Miller. This road that we are looking at is a smaller scale project. This that we're looking at is a downscaled project by the government. I've been looking and trying to research it, but I cannot find any any plans that would take this four lane road and say it has been downscaled. Did they plan to build an eight lane road or a six lane road? No, there were plans to build a toll road going through the hills to Port Antonio. But this current government decided to build the road going through the towns, which seems to be the correct 
move. But the, this project could never be considered a downscale smaller project. This is the largest road project on the way in Jamaica. Now, the only other project that I can think of to compare to this project in terms of size would be building a highway from Kingston to Ocho Rios or the expansion of the Northern Coastal Highway, although that road has not that project has not started yet. I cannot imagine this road that we are looking at to be considered a downsized project. Guys, if anybody knows what those plans were for them to consider this a downscale project, let us know. Leave your comments in the section below. Alright guys, enjoy the rest of the video. Have a good day.